now that the weather is starting to warm up, when you go out there with your winter makeup, you start to feel like you're wearing a bit of a mask. So we thought, Tracy, we would get you to talk about how you can pare down your makeup for the summer season. We've got our model Anne here. And so you're half in winter gear, what most of us would wear for the winter, which is fairly heavy makeup, mm -hmm, right? Mm -hmm. Can you just look straight ahead in that camera and we can get a look? And so what would you do to maybe go a little bit lighter, starting with the foundation? This is the heavier side. That's the heavier side. In the winter time, the winds are cold. It, makeup almost acts like a protective layer, whereas in the summer, it's the exact opposite. The more makeup you're wearing, the harder it is, number one, to maintain. And yeah. it's also suffocating your skin and it's clogging the pores. So the only way to fight that is to put on less makeup. Right. Okay? So you don't need to go as heavy in the summer. You don't need to go as heavy in the summer. It's only going to cause you problems. Right. Okay, so the first step, to look out of sight, keep your application light. Okay? okay. So what you want to do is you want to go with tinted moisturizers, things like BB creams. They're meant to, they're formulated so they can go on like a second skin. Mm -hmm. Really natural looking. So what you want to do is you want to get a foundation brush similar to this and you always want to start on the inside of the face and work your way out and work your way down the neck. So start on the inside of the face and just kind of blend your way out like this. Okay. That's the easiest way to get like a really sheer application. I know you, that people love the BBs because it's almost they're like... They're very popular. Yeah, it's almost like putting on nothing at all, but you do feel like you have a layer of something, but it's so light. Exactly. And you want to make sure you get your coverage from this, okay? You want to just make sure. And if you have, I know some people are thinking, uh oh, that's not enough coverage for me. Yeah. If you have things like blemishes or redness in the skin that you want to cover, you want to stipple the brush. You want to take it and you want to pat it like this over certain areas like that and then just blend out the edges. You can get coverage with BB creams and tinted moisturizers. Okay, good stuff. So we've done the foundation, you've lightened up. Where do we go next? Okay, tip number two, never let them see you sweat. Use yeah. translucent, <laughs> trans translucent to set. Okay. okay. What you want to do is use a translucent powder. Throw out your pressed powders, throw out your two-in-one powders. They're too heavy for the summer. Right. You want to go with something like this, a translucent powder. It has little to no color. It's exactly that, translucent. Is okay? it different for different complexions, the translucent, they or it doesn't really matter? They usually come in three colors, light, medium, and dark, because that's how little color there is to them, okay? okay? So what you're going to do is take a face brush like this, and you're just going to go over it to set. Basically what a, a blot powder, this is from MAC, but this is a blot powder, but it's the same thing, a translucent powder. Mm -hmm. Its sole purpose is to set makeup and to mattify skin, but it's going to go on a lot lighter than a powder. Remember, you're not going to get your coverage from this. You're going to get it from the BB cream or the tinted moisturizer. This is just to set, but it feels so lightweight as opposed to a press powder or two-in-one powder, which a lot of people tend to use. Got it. Keep that for the winter time. Okay. All right. So now we go to uh, the next step, which would be what? Three in one, and then you're done. Three in one, and then you're done. Okay, okay so what is this all going to do? <laughs> a three in one is uh, eyeshadow, uh -huh. uh, blush, and uh, lip color all mixed in one. That's NARS handy. has a great one. There's called the multiple. Mm -hmm. it's, a, it's a three in one all together. It's a really good way to pare down your makeup for the summer. Okay. Basically, take a brush. You could use her fingers, but I don't think she'd appreciate me using her, my fingers on her today. <laughs> and basically, you want a one wash of color. It, it's really simple. Just go over the eyes. You always want to start light and then just build. You okay. don't want to put too much on and then have to take it off. That's going to be a problem. Over there, we have multiple colors going on. By the end of a hot day, it's going to kind of look like a kaleidoscope kind of mosaic <laughs> thing going on, and it's all going to blend together. You want to keep it really simple with one wash of color like this. Okay, so when I look at something like that and I think that's supposed to go on your lips too? It goes on your lips and it goes on your cheeks. You can go in and use that same foundation brush that you use to put your foundation on, mm -hmm. and then just kind of apply it right here to the cheeks as well. Cool. And make sure you concentrate on the apples of the cheeks. The apples of the cheeks is where you would naturally yeah. get sun. It's where you'd naturally be flush, not on the outside of your face here. Right. So this is where it's going to look most natural. And you just build to your desire. So what's cool about this is that you're also saving money. Like you're if saving you get a money. three in one and you can use it on everything, yeah, exactly. you're going to save some money. So do we have time, uh, Amber Rose, for one more? Let us know and we'll go for it. Yeah, next step. Okay, uh, marker <laughs> liner, okay? okay? What happens when we use pencil liners? Pencil liners have products in them that like, uh, have an ingredient called coal. When it's mixed with heat, it smears. You look like a raccoon by the end of the day. Right. What you want to do is you want to go with a marker liner like this. No matter how hot it gets once this is set, mm -hmm. it's going to... It's not going to go anywhere. It's not going to move. Interesting, because I would think that the the uh, you know the marker would be worse than the no. Than once the it's set, it stays. It's Whereas stay. a pencil eyeliner, they smear, they move, yeah. they just pick up their bags and travel across your face. <laughs> 
and you don't want that. I just got that image in my mind. Yeah, they're, like, they're like, we're going to go over I'm here. Over here. Yeah, that's All what right, happens. so now we know how to lighten up your makeup for summer. <laughs> Very nice. Let's go to break. We got more